Philippine Navy saw the importance of having its own ocean-going tugboats after the accidental grounding of the Philippine Navy's BRP Gregorio del Pilar in the Hassa Hassa Shoal, at the municipality of Calayan, province of Palawan way back in August 2018. The Philippine Navy started the harbor and ocean-going tugboats acquisition project in second quarter of 2020, acquiring one harbor tugboats and one ocean-going tugboats with integrated logistics support included. The harbor and ocean-going tugboats acquisition project is part of the second list of Horizon 2 phase of the revised AFP modernization program, with an approved budget for the contract worth 600 million Philippine peso, won by Josefa Slipways Incorporated. The harbor tugboats shall have at least 26 meters long, displaces of at least 400 tons a crew of 10 personnel and has a bollard pull of at least 40 tons. The ocean-going tugboats will have at least 30 meters long, displaces of at least 600 tons a crew of 10 personnel and has a bollard pull of at least 60 tons. The Department of National Defense released the notice of award in favor of Josefa Slipway Incorporated on August 31, 2021, which the company submitted a bid worth 598,808,000 Philippine peso, lower than the budget of the Philippine Navy. According to Max Defense Philippines, the Philippine Navy will be having another acquisition of two boats for the year 2022 and 2023. End.